Hey everyone, it's Maria. Welcome back to my channel and today I am doing a back to school makeup tutorial and I think this is honestly a good makeup look for anyone in high school. Um, I think if you're in middle school and you want to wear makeup, you could probably simplify this a little bit. This makeup look is just super easy and it's really natural and I really, really like it. I think it's like a really good routine to settle into. So I hope you guys like it and let's just get right into the video. Okay, so the first thing I do is use this Mario Badescu spray. Really good, it's the rose water one and I just like to spray this all over my face. And I just kind of let this like sink into my skin and let it just dry a bit. Also to prep like my face and like my skin and all that, I use this Smith's Minted Rose Lip Balm and I've been using this for years. It's super, super good and it doesn't really give you any color like it looks like it would, but... So like right now I'm having a pretty bad skin week, like I have definitely a few spots on my face. So whenever I'm having like a bad skin week or anything, I use this ultra repair tinted moisturizer and it's by first aid beauty and they have it at like sephora and stuff so i just get this and i put it right on my face and then i blend it in with a beauty blender i honestly prefer like a tinted moisturizer over anything else like bb cream or foundation just because like at school i don't like wearing anything on my face on a normal basis so, like, wearing it to school especially, I don't like feeling like there's a lot on my skin, and this is, like, super lightweight. I like to use the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer, and this is in the shade number 10, Light, and I just go over all my little, like, blemishes and stuff with this. So for my under eye circles, I'm just taking the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind with the Fit Me Concealer and I'm just going to blend these both under my eyes. I'm using the lighter one first and then I'm going to go in with the darker one on top. Okay, so now for powder, I take the... Cody Airspun Powder and I have tape on it because mine kind of cracked. So I just take this and I put it under my eyes with a sponge. So now I'm just going to take off any excess powder with this Real Techniques blush brush. So now I'm taking this same brush and I'm going in with my Hula Bronzer from Benefit. I'm also bronzing down to like my neck and stuff because you don't want your face to be a different color than your neck. I didn't put any foundation or whatever BB cream and stuff or concealer on my eyelids and this is just my kind of like life hack for looking like you're wearing eyeshadow just because if you have dark eyelids it's gonna look like you're wearing eyeshadow so you might as well just like skip that stuff and I don't know I just think it looks nice. So I'm just gonna brush out my eyebrows with a spoolie. So I'm going to be going in with the NYX Tinted Brow Mascara. Um, there's like a ton of really good brow mascaras and brow gels out there. Using like brow mascara and stuff is like super super efficient for like getting ready really fast just because I feel like it's so much better than like trying to like outline your eyebrows or something or like make it like super harsh. Okay, so I'm kind of like hopping around with like what part of my face I'm doing, but now I'm going to go in with some blush and this is the Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush in the color Parte. Yeah. Um, so I just put a little bit on the apples of my cheeks with an angled blush brush. Okay, so now for highlighter, I feel like highlighter during the school year can make your face look so much more awake and just alive. And you know, everyone at school is always super tired, so I'm taking this e.l.f. highlighter in the color Moonlight Pearls, and I'm going to put this on my brow bone, inner corner, nose, and cheeks, and a little bit on my cupid's bow. So the last step to finish off the look is some mascara, and mascara honestly takes me the longest, and it's just because like I like to take my time and work it through my eyelashes, and so I like to use the Roller Lash by Benefit, and it's just in the black color. I think there's only two shades, but yeah, so this is my favorite mascara of like all time. I've tried so many different mascaras. This one lasts the longest, looks the best, 
and yeah it's really good and I don't even have to curl my eyelashes with this so I'm just gonna go in with that really fast and then I'll be right back so the very finishing step for my makeup look is to put on some setting spray and this is the NYX matte finish long lasting spray so I'm just gonna spray this on and then that's it that was it for this tutorial I really hope you guys liked it I'm probably going to start doing some more back to school videos, so comment down below if there's anything particular that you want to see. Um, I'm going into my senior year, so it's going to be really exciting, some big stuff in store, and yeah. So if you like this video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!